Oh, yeah. Libby. There we go. Libby. Go. Look at that. I think the first thing I'm going to do is get my saw and cut this bush out of here so we can actually Okay, work. guys. This is probably one of my more stupid ideas. I... Got the idea to tie Trooper's favorite toy to a string to the ceiling fan. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. So I gotta get this. I don't know how long it's gonna be. I've never done this before. <laughs> Guys, I'm afraid that if he, oh, hello, he's already got a head start. <laughs> I'm afraid that if he pulls, this is his favorite, if he pulls too hard, he might break the, the ceiling fan. Oh, I could, never mind. No, I thought I could tie it onto the metal part, but Trippy, hold on. This is one of mommy's dumber ideas. <laughs> the smell? No, I got it. I don't want him to grab it right now, because... Oh, here, let me hold the little longer. Well, I don't know. I need to know how long it's going to be. What do you think? Yeah, I think that works. You think that's long enough? Well, he grabbed it. This. Here, we'll let, let it drop for a second. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. Here, grab you. Yeah. I was trying to, I had the idea to put, oh, I can put it on the metal part. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. It is? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Now I'm going to cut off the excess so nothing gets tangled up. And we don't have a helicopter in the room. Hey guys. <laughs> yep. Tripper. <laughs> He's already got it. <laughs> Let go. Tripper. <laughs> yeah, go <laughs> Look at him, he's <laughs> Oh Jesus, he chased it for the longest <laughs> It's not, it's not going, like it's not Yeah what is that tree? I think he's figured it out. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> he's hypnotized. Look at him. <gasps> Look at him. He's like hypnotized. Now see, if I would have tied it onto a blade, it would be going like... Yeah. Might need to do that. <laughs> I think it's the noise. I don't know if he's like... Like he just keeps staring at the fan. There it goes. He's making it go himself. <laughs> Troopy. <laughs> He's like, yeah, this is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, take two. We moved it onto a wider part of the fan. 
Troopy, give it a chance, baby. Hold on. Give it a chance. Let go. Give it a chance. Hold on. Give it a chance. <laughs> Trooper. <laughs> let go, poops. I know. I let go and it'll go away. Let go. I think it's again it's still too close to the it's just bouncing around well let's just uh yeah it's just stick it all the way to the end and tape it <laughs> <laughs> look at guys it's like going it's like flying now I gotta get my phone, guys. Sorry. Where is my phone? In here. Oh, here it is. Oh, dang it. Alright, we're gonna move it. We're gonna. What? What speed you got that fan on? Two? Is it too much? It's like bouncing. It's like. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what Slow to do. Slow it down to one, see what happens. Whoa, hello. It just grabbed my camera, you guys. Yeah, one, it doesn't make as big One's as not enough, and two is too much. <laughs> doesn't make as big as circles. He's definitely being kept busy by it. Libby's like intrigued. <clears throat> Are you getting bored, Tripper? Are you getting tired? Oh, there's the scissors. <laughs> oh, you found them? Yeah. Oh, it, it, there it goes, there it goes, look, it was gone for a second. And that's all it does, you guys. He likes it, though. Yeah. Whoa, hello. <laughs> and of course, um... Guys, we're not going to leave it up, of course. We don't want him to hang himself or whatever, so. Yeah, it's just an experiment. I don't know, for some reason, it just popped into my head. Let's tie a toy to the ceiling fan. I don't know where I got it. It just popped into my head. There it goes. Yeah, there it goes. And Trooper disrupted the flow. <laughs> He's going to sleep good tonight. <laughs> My boy, it's my boy. I'm afraid to stop recording because I'm afraid he's going to do something funny. <laughs> <laughs> but I know. My viewers don't want to see my cat going in circles all Well, I was going to film the, the cats for you guys. They were rolling around in catnip just now, but I do have a quick story time for you. So, I've already posted this on TikTok and Facebook, but I need to tell you guys. So, we were at Walmart, right? And there's this kid playing basketball and dribbling down the aisles, right? And I can understand if you want to buy a ball and you want to know how much air is in it, you bounce it a few times just to get a feel for it. That's one thing. But you don't play basketball in the store, right? So, um... We were in the dairy aisle, and 
he was like hovering in that general area for a really long time and I already thought that was suspicious right so then he walked by me and I had said to myself I didn't say it to him I said to myself I'm like I'm like geez this is not a playground this is a store you know what if he hits a child or elderly person well um he walked by us and he's all you know he starts chuckling and it was at that moment I knew he was up to something right so then we were over by the cottage cheese and we saw a prank and um I look over and I'm thinking I'm like why is he still here why is he still in this area right and I'm like wait a minute the ball's not bouncing it's quiet right I look down and he's recording me he's filming me right I go off on this kid. I'm like, yeah, you know what? You want to film me, you little bastard? You want to film me? Come on, go ahead. I'm like, you don't have my permission to film me. And the minute I went off on him, he turned around and he left real quick. Like, he left so fast. Like, it was... If you're going to record somebody, you need to have their permission. You don't just go film people in the public place, right? And, um... <clears throat> I'm like, this is not a playground. This is a store. I'm like, you little shit. You know what? Come on, record me. You know what? You don't have my... I, I yelled at this kid. I yelled at him. And it's like, it seems like he was all ballsy and all, you know, tough and everything. But the minute I went off on him, he turned around so quick. It wasn't even funny. So, I'm going to check the For You page on TikTok and see. <laughs> I'm going to see if he posts it. If he does, though, all, all I got to do is just report it. And I'm going to say, hey, that's me, and he did not have permission to record me. And my lens is dirty. Can you see me, guys? My lens is dirty. And they'll take it down, you know? So, yeah, it's that easy. So, yeah, I was prepared to show you Trooper and uh, Kisa. Hold on. How's that? Better? So, there's Trooper. High on catnip. Trooper. Hey. Troopy. Hey. Say hi to mommy's viewers. Say hi. Here's Yibby. Here's Yibby. What? Oh, camera whore. Jesus. Yibby. Yibby. Jealousy. Gosh. I call Libby over and he gets upset. And there's a Kiza Gill. This is Auntie's Kiza Gill. Alright, so. I don't know. I just thought I'd vlog a little bit. Just stay in the life of CT and Trooper. Oh, guys! Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hey guys, I almost forgot to tell you, I got this stuff on Wish. And it's a, um, it's just a cheap little, I didn't know it was going to be foamy. Um, I can't tell. I can't even tell if you can see me, you guys. I can't tell if you can, in my in frame. Um, but see, it's a little, see, there's that. There's the red one. Pink. that one so yeah um the uh it's like a i don't know how to explain it like a gel almost like i don't uh, so um and then i got my sweatsuit you guys i got my sweatsuit i've been waiting for a month and a half for this sweatsuit i'm just gonna wipe it off and i finally got it i'm so happy so here's the top. Oh wait, no, these are the bottoms. My bad. These the bottoms. These little things are all over it, and I don't get it, you guys. These little, just like black. These little black fuzzies are all over. Do you see that? This my Adidas. I cannot wait to put this on. And then here's the top. 
almost two months, you guys. I woke up, I got a notification, it says, a wish item you ordered has been delivered. I'm like, no way. No way. And I got refunded for this, y'all. Nicole's got a little hoodie on top. Hey, Cole, huh? This is so cute. Um, the fabric is okay. It's a little thinner than I expected, but it's wish. What do you expect? But the inside is like really, really fuzzy. It's like really fuzzy. So, yeah, I almost forgot about that, you guys. There's two. Say hi to mommy's viewers. Say hi, little Tob. Say hi, little Tob. He's too high. Maybe he's a goo. That's a camera, honey. You can't kiss it. Why not? Hey, do yibby girl. Hey, yibby. She's like, um, what is that you have? I don't know. I'm not sure. I'll go around. What is that? So. Yeah, almost forgot. So I just thought I'd show you guys. So, see you later. One eternity later. Hey guys, so this is what it looks like on um, these. I think I'm on the sweat part. I'm gonna have to tie a knot um, because look how easy they. You know, it just to me it just strikes me as just a very long, cheap shoestring um, with flugel binders. <laughs> on the ends of them. Um, and this is the same way, look, I can just move it like this. So I'm going to have to tie knots on the ends um, to keep them from going out. But other than that, and I, you know what, I think, you guys, um, it's comfortable, it's cozy. Um, I honestly think the, the pockets are kind of shallow, but again, it's wish what I expect. Um, I think, I'm wondering if they had to make this before they sent it out that's what I'm wondering because number one it took so long and then number two the tags that are supposed to have the size and all the information written on the tags they're blank like there's no information written on the tags like where's the tag it's over here look at this you guys it's supposed to have a size and like numbers and stuff there's no look they're blank there's no size written on the tag at all <laughs> so I'm just wondering if they had to make it but hey that's hey I mean it's Mel's brand spanking new like it just like it's just rolled off the showroom floor so but yeah I like it I'm very happy and I want to order more clothes but I don't want them to take this long but I would like to order more colors but hey, I like it. I like it. Okay, right, everybody. Later, guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you are returning, welcome back. If you are new to my channel, go down, hit that big red subscribe button. Give me a big thumbs up. Turn on post notifications. Make sure the little lines are on the bells. Otherwise, you won't get notified of every video. Um, we are going to do another mini investigation. Um, I, for the last couple of weekends, at least since last weekend, and this weekend every once in a while I get poked in the back I, I just feel like it's either Bob or Joe I just feel like one of them is like you know just poking the heck out of me and I'm getting annoyed really I'm just really starting to get annoyed um, last weekend um, I threatened Bob with the sage and he quit <laughs> so for those of you who doesn't know sage is like kryptonite to I don't know if I'm saying this right to a spare, though. They don't like it. it it'll keep them away. So, um, and then Vicky, um, you want to tell them what you told me? What? About the dinging? Oh, yeah. This morning, about a quarter to six, I heard chimes in my bedroom. Chimes I've never heard before. Wasn't the, the clock that we have out here. Wasn't nothing. It was coming from the corner of my bedroom. Hmm. By my alarm clocks and stuff, but none of those were were on. Wow. Yeah, so, yeah, it's a noise she's never heard before. So, when we get something like that going on, we'd like to know what's happening. So, um, I have the spear box. I have two different spear boxes here. I have the good old-fashioned SB7, and I also have the uh, Necrophonic. We also have the um, EMF meter, and we are going to see... 
that was the app starting up. <laughs> so I don't think it was something, you know. Um, um, and just a little disclaimer. Uh, Vicki has these little, um, I'll show you guys. She has these little, um, these things. And they go off. They go off. Yeah, Glade Fresheners. They go off every half hour or whatever. And I've actually had a viewer tell me, hey, I heard something in the background. No, it's okay. It was just a freshener. But thank you for that. I do appreciate that. I'd rather, you know, have you guys tell me what it is and I debunk it and then not know it all and have it be something really cool. So, I'm going to start this one up in Necrophonic. If you're not aware of this, it is ten dollars on the App Store or the the um, Play Store for iPhone and Android. So we're gonna start this up and see what we get. So, is there anybody here with us, Bob or Joe or Tony or Alan? Alan, you guys, is the guy who previously owned this trailer, so that's why we're throwing his name out. If anybody is here, can you speak into this device and I'll be able to hear you? I do. I heard that. Can you tell me your name? No, not right now. Not right now. Sorry. Sorry, guys. That's his play toy he wants to play, and it's not a good time right now. I'm sorry. Can you tell me your name? Whoa. You guys. What the heck? What? It just turned off. By itself. You better just not. No. What the heck, you guys? It just turned off. That is crazy. I just went over to pick up the toy and it. No, it's at seventy-five percent. There's no reason. Oh, guys, look. I don't know if you can see. Seventy-five percent. So there's no reason for it to turn off. So let's try this again. Again, app starting up. <coughs> who turned off my spirit box here? Can you tell me who turned it off? <coughs> Trooper, stop. What the heck? Why did a phone notification come through on here? Joe, are you here? Me? Did you hear that? Bob, are you here? That's a trooper. It sounded like I heard trooper. Yeah. Now that you said it, I'm thinking back to the sound, and yeah, it does sound like tripping. What am I pointing to? What is that right there? Yep. You hear that? Pussy. No. What? Did you hear that? Guys, if you heard that, let me know if you heard that. It sounded... This is going to sound crazy, you guys. It's going to sound off the wall. 
but I got a whisper. And when I said, what am I pointing to? I'm pointing to Trooper, guys. When I said, what am I pointing to? A whisper came through and said, pussy. <laughs> I swear, you guys. I'm going to look back and see if I caught that, though. It was just crazy. Gone. Look. Yeah. Gone. Yeah. Shut up, you guys. It said gone, and Trooper's not there no more. He was sitting right there. He's old? Can you tell me your name? Those are the cats wrestling. What's that right there? Who is that? What's her name? Have heard that. Are you serious? I'm serious. I heard uh, straight a woman say Kisa. You guys, if that you heard would be, that. Yeah, that would be Tony. She knew who Kisa was. She's the only one. That you would guys, be if you heard that, let me know. I'm going to try to go back down into the, um, to the footage and I'm going to try to find it and I'll put subtitles up for you. Oh my god. Who said that? Who said her name? <laughs> Tony, was that you? No. Did you hear that? Loud and clear. No. Who was it? Who was it then? Because <laughs> she's the only one that was known to Kisa. Unless it's somebody who has heard her name nope. before. Joe, are you here? What's his name? Carrie. Carrie? I heard my name. What's his name? Whoa. Gray. Gray. Gray? Gray? I heard gray or something? I felt like a tickle on the back of my head right here. Does anybody know her, Libby? Nobody? Joe? Well, Tony did. And Tony never met her? No. Oh. Let, well, tell her that there are oh cats. Jackie's cat. Her? Yeah. Um, Tony, that orange kitty on the table there is Jackie's cat. <laughs> no way. No way. What? You guys, did you hear that? Please tell me you heard that. I was in the kitchen when that went up. I was showing Libby, right? And I was zooming in and she put her nose up to the to the lens. Uh huh. And I heard zoom. I heard that too. It's that is crazy. Guys, I'm going to turn this on, but I'm not going to put it close to the phone because I found out the hard way that phones make these go off. <laughs> so, um, Bob, if there's anybody here, can you make this uh, turn colors, Bob or Joe or Tony? Make it go to red. Hey, look. Look, it just went off. 
I can see the reflection in the lens. This device won't hurt you. I'm trying not to get too close to the phone, guys, because, as of course, makes it go off, so. I can see the reflection, you guys, of the lights and the lens, so if it goes off, I'll, I'll know it. Bob, do you remember last time you made this go off? Can you make this go off again? Can you make it go off for, for um, Vicky? Sure. Did you hear that? Vicky's going to Helena tomorrow to go to work. She wants you to ride with her. Keep her safe. That device won't hurt you. I'm gonna, guys, I'm gonna switch to the old fashioned spray box. Watch that because I can't watch it <laughs> while I'm doing this. Oh, where'd it go? There it is. You can speak into this device too, guys. I'm gonna use the SB7. You can speak into this device too. Is there anybody here? I heard me. It sounds weird tonight. It just sounds different. Okay, guys, I'm going backwards now. See? Joe, are you here? Robert? I heard Robert. Did you hear that? Joe, are you here? Bob, are you here? Where? I heard that. Where? Can you come touch it? Oh! No, I was not that close to it at all. Look, I'm back in the same area and it's not. No. Because her phone is all the way over there with her. Right there. That one's over there and it, this thing just went off. Can you come touch this? It won't hurt you. 
Okay. I know you don't know me, so I'm going to put this over here. You guys, you can see I'm putting the phone all the way over there. Why did my... What the heck, you guys? This just went... This just went crazy on me. What the hell? The speaker stopped working. Again? Yeah. There it goes. Are you? Did you hear it? You guys, did you hear that? Yeah, I'm here. Are you here? Since that stuff happened in your room, I want to go check it out. So, guys, we're going to go into um, Libby. Say hi to the viewers. Say hi, YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. Um, since this happened in her room next to the... She sat over by the um, sewing machine. I'm going to give you guys a quick... The sewing machine is over here. So I'm going to go over there and see if maybe I get something. This is the uh, EMF meter. Joe, are you in here? I know this was your room. Oh my God. Joe, you can come touch this meter. It won't hurt you. It'll just light up and let us know you're here. That's Vicky, you guys. So you heard it over here somewhere? Yeah. That's weird. I didn't hear it anywhere between the nightstand and the... And that corner? Because I was getting up to check that clock there. That's weird. I didn't touch it from the bed. So I'm going to put it... Let's see. Oh, wait. It's the clock doing that. Okay. So guys, I tested it against the clock, and it's the clock, so. So Joe, um, if you see what I just did, if you can make this do that, that would be great. Let's see what I'll turn on the light for a second. It won't do it on this one. Oh wait. Wait, that's weird. It does a little. Yeah. It's weird. How come when I tap it? S. When I tap it, it does it. I wonder if I got a dud. Because <laughs> look, when I tap it, yeah. it's weird. Ask Bob if he knows what that thing in the corner is. What is it? Shotgun. Oh shit, I did not know you had a gun. <laughs> it's loaded too, so be careful. Oh fuck. You Actually, Joe would know too because he loaded it for me. Oh my god, you guys. You see that right there? That's Bob's. That's, that's a shotgun. Loaded. I did not know. <laughs> I've been coming out here every weekend for almost like over six months and I didn't know. I guess I should have told you if you ever needed it, huh? Yeah, thanks. I could have been raped and robbed and left for dead. Look, 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 look. Look. It was going off. Look, look, look. 
We were talking about the gun. Joe or Bob, was that you? We're talking about that gun. That's Bob if you recognize it. Hey Bob, do you recognize that gun in the corner? Look. Joe, did you load that for Vicky? Because we were just talking about the gun and it started going off. And there's nothing over here on the chair that would make it go off. Mm -mm. So it's just, you know. Bob, are you here? Do you want to touch this meter? It won't hurt you. You hold it, maybe he'll come over for you. Honey, you want to come touch this meter? Hold it, hold it out like that. It's better for you. Yeah, like that. Bob, Vicky has it now. It won't hurt you, it just lights up and lets us know you're here. Touch the meter or if you recognize that gun over there. I just like, ugh, God. All of a sudden, I just got kind of just like kind of a little bit creeped out with that. <laughs> I got a little creeped out. <laughs> well, just don't go playing around with it. Oh, no, I won't touch it unless I have to, <laughs> you know. Here, take the camera. I'm going to go um, keep it on the spirit box. I'm going to go or on the ammo. I'm going to go get the spirit box. See if Bob or Jill will talk. Bob or Joe, if you want to talk, um, that gun over there. We were talking about that gun. Do you recognize that? <laughs> what is that in the corner? A gun? A gun? Did you hear that? Like it was like kind of drawn out though. Mm -hmm. Like a gun. Like that. Jo Joe, did you load that up for Vicky? Sure. sure. Oh I my heard god! That. that was loud you guys! Thank you for answering, Joe. <laughs> Joe, can you come touch the meter that she has in her hand? It won't hurt you. Yep. yep. Nope. <laughs> nope. I hate the whispers. They creep me out. Don't laugh. Did you hear that? Yeah. I heard like a whisper. I said, don't laugh. I'm sorry. I just get excited when stuff happens. I feel like when they talk through this, it's a lot easier for them that they don't, they don't have to get through all that white noise. I feel like it takes more energy to get through all the white noise. And this doesn't take as much energy. 
Is that true, what I just said? It's true? Mm. Kisa! I heard that. Oh my god! Is she here? I'm looking around. No, she's not in here. Shut up! That was loud! Bob. Did you hear that? I heard it sound like Bob. What's my cat's name? The little gray cat. What's his name? They're like, we don't know you call him so much. We <laughs> so many. I swear to God, if I hear troopers, clear as I heard case, I'm going to die. What's the orange cat's name? I hate when they all come through at once because I gotta listen to everyone and I'm trying to. You know what? When mm. I lived, you guys, I got a story to tell you. When I lived, um, my brother used to live in Montesano, Washington, and I lived there for a while. And, um, right outside my window, um, my brother was so polite. Like, he was, like, a criminal. Like, he's a Dillinger. And, yes, he, they're related to the Dillingers that you think I'm talking about. But, and those are my half-brothers and sisters. But my brother Bill, um, he's passed on. But he, I mean, he spent most of his life in prison. Like, I remember he stole one of his dad's horses. And he made a big deal of it saying, well, you know, if, um, you know, if this would have been in the Western days, you'd have been hanged for that. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. Well, um, uh, I heard, I had the window open in my room, and I heard my brother crystal clear. Like, okay, sorry guys, my, my camera cut off. So, my brother spent a lot of time in prison. Like, he spent most of his life in prison. But I'm telling you, if you were to meet him, he's just so polite. Like, if you meet him, he'd be like, well, hello there, young lady. How are you? You know, he's just really polite. And when I had my window open, I thought it was the neighbors talking. And I heard very clear, as I'm talking to you, I heard, well, hello there. Hmm. And I looked out the window, thinking it was the neighbors, and there were no neighbors outside. And I, I got to talking to somebody about it, and I told someone about it, and they're like, well, that was probably your brother. Because he lived in the same town I was living in. So that was so weird. That was just so creepy. And me and my brother were really close. He wrote me a letter from prison, and he goes, you're my little baby sister, and I don't care what anybody has to say about it. If someone's got a problem with that, I'll kick their ass. <laughs> Okay, we're going to try the old-fashioned spirit box. Bob, are you here? Joe, are you here? Oh! It's just a little yeah. Look. Yeah, it's gone to yellow. Oh, what? there it's gone. Hey, thank you. Bob, is that you? Oops. Did you hear that? Oops. Bob, is that you? Hello. 
Bob, if that's you, make it light up. Alrighty. Alrighty, did you hear that? And I'm going backwards. Joe, if that's you, make it light up. Please. Guys, I'm going backwards. No, I'm going backwards. Look. It's going backwards. Who is making that chiming noise Vicky heard? Can you tell me what's in the corner over there? What's in the corner over there? Okay, they don't seem to like this one. Okay, what's in the corner over there? Can you tell me what that is? Guys, that's a. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there. Right there at the rifle, right there. No, it's fine. Oh shoot. Well Oh wait. Guys, I'm not I'm not using my normal phone, so I don't know. That's the gun right there. Right there. I thought it was I don't know why. What is that right there in the corner? They're probably not too sure about that EMF meter because it's like they came and then they're like, I don't know about that. You know? And guys, it takes, um, it took a while for Joe and Bob to come through. Tony, I don't think she's ready to talk quite yet. She's probably still, and I know this is going to sound crazy, but she's probably still dealing, getting over the shock of dying. So she's probably, you know, trying to process it and deal with it so I don't think she's ready to come through yet but it took us a while before Joe and Bobby would even come through so um yeah we even went to their graves and they wouldn't come through it took them a while to get to know me so all this new equipment is probably freaking them out right now so they probably don't know what to think about it Night, you hear that? 
Nope. All right, well, we're going to go to bed because Vicky has to go to uh, yeah. Helena tomorrow. And my battery's already dying. What the hell? Why is it dying? All right, guys. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta split. My battery's about to die. But um, if you if you heard anything in the um, EVPs that I missed in the editing process, go ahead, timestamp it, put it down below, and I will talk to you later.